Daily Devotion with Pastor Bala for August 17, 2020, from 2 Samuel chapter 24, Census. Verse 1, again, the anger of the Lord was kindled against Israel, and he incited David against them, saying, Go, number Israel and Judah. There would be only one reason why the Lord would be angry with Israel. It's because of sin. But notice this sin was against, and anger was against Israel, not David. Because Judah was named with Israel later on in the verse, so we can guess that the Lord's anger was really against the northern tribes of Israel, but yet Judah would also be included in the census. Keep in mind that the Lord is doing this and moved and incited David to do so. So the command was given. Verse 3, But Joab said to the king, May the Lord your God add to the people a hundred times as many as they are, while the eyes of my lord the king still sees it. But why does my lord the king delight in this thing? Joab asks a good question. The answer, the king says it, so it will happen. Verse 9, And Joab gave the sum of the numbering of the people to the king. In Israel there were 800,000 valiant men who drew the sword, and the men of Judah were 500,000. What would David do with this information? Verse 10, but David's heart struck him after he had numbered the people. And David said to the Lord, I have sinned greatly in what I have done. But now, O Lord, please take away the iniquity of your servant, for I have done very foolishly. Verse 12. Go and say to David, Thus says the Lord, Three things I offer you. Choose one of them, that I may do it to you. So Gad came to David and told him and said to him, Shall three years of famine come to you in the land? Or will you flee three months before your foes while they pursue you? Or shall there be three days pestilence in your land? Now consider and decide what answer I shall return to him who sent me. David had a beautiful response. Knowing that something bad was going to happen, how do you choose the badness, so to speak? David says in verse 14, Then David said to Gad, I am in great distress. Let us fall into the hand of the Lord, for his mercy is great. But let me not fall into the hand of man. David knew that the Lord would be gracious, that the Lord would forgive, the Lord would have mercy even in the midst of all the bad things that were happening around him. David knew to trust in the Lord. Yes, David confessed his sin, and he knew that once you confess your sin, once you admit that you're a sinner, God's grace and forgiveness comes through. Join me again tomorrow as we hear a little bit more about the consequences of these actions and the Lord's final answer to all of this. God's peace and many blessings be with you. Thank you for watching and please take an opportunity to share this video with others. If you have enjoyed these daily devotions, please consider sending, making a donation to Peace Lutheran Church, 24024 West Main Street, Plainfield, Illinois, 60544. Thank you again for watching.